Yes, these are dancing broccolis. But let's ignore them for now and focus on the Williams Alligator trade and strategy. I have backtested this trade and strategy 100 times on two currency pairs. You will see the results and likely they will surprise you. I also made little tweaks on this trade and strategy to make it even better and show you a live trade I placed on this trade and video. Also, if you're looking for a trading community, link down in the description below. We have a Discord community. We smash the markets as always. And without further ado, let's just get down to the video. Okay, traders. So let me show you the trading strategy. First, go inside the indicators, metrics, and strategies on Trading View. Type in Williams Alligator. Under technicals, you will see Williams Alligator. So you will click on it. These are the default values for the Williams Alligator 13, 8, 5. 8, 5 and 3. We don't want to change any of them at all. We will also add a little bit of thickness for the lines as well. All right, beautiful. Let's now understand the trading strategy. For a buying position, we want all three alligator lines over here to be below the candlesticks. Ideally, we want to enter on a bullish engulfing candlestick such as this one. If we wanted to long this position, we want our stop loss to be below all three moving averages. So around seven pips should be sufficient. We're going to do the same thing for take profit, one to one risk reward ratio. And because we are scalping and because how profitable this trading strategy is, that should be sufficient enough for you to make a profit. So let's just quickly have a look and see what actually happens. After a bullish engulfing candlestick, the market continues shooting towards the upside, reaching our first take profit level. Vice versa for a short trading position, we would enter on a bearish engulfing candlestick just over here move our stop loss just above the three moving averages and do the same thing over here so six pips six pips one to one risk reward ratio why is this a good trading position because after this little upwards move we had a nice little break over here towards the downside, the moving average over here has been broken. You could have potentially even entered over here as well. And likely it could have been a nice trading position. So let's just take a look at how it performs and it shoots towards the downside nicely, reaching our first take profit level. Okay, now that we understand how the Williams alligator actually works, we want to backtest how this strategy performs without any enhancements. After the results, we will likely try to improve this trading strategy and I have a few ways to do it. Okay, so let's try backtesting EURUSD 5 minute time frame. 1 to 1 risk to reward ratio, I will keep the default as it is. Okay, so we finished our back testing win rate 62%, which is really surprising. 26% uh, profit and loss, total trades 100, profit factor 1.63. We had 12 consecutive wins, 6 consecutive losses. It actually performed really, really well. The time period for these trades was a little bit less than a month. Let's see how we can actually improve it. I believe we can actually improve this trading strategy if we follow the overall trend and direction. Since I placed only buy and sell orders on the five minute time frame uh, or using the Williams Alligator indicator, I do believe that if we only place sell orders, let's say somewhere from over here where there was a nice candlestick closure on the daily time frame, just from this area zone, the market always was trending towards the downside. So likely it will have much better results. So if we only stick to what we know, which is selling trading position and following the trend, I believe we can improve this trading strategy even more. Okay, so we are here on the five minute time frame where I just marked. Let me remove that. We have a back testing platform over here as well. Initial balance of $1,000. Let's see how it performs now. So we finally completed the back test and if we have a look at our back test, 71% win rate, profit and loss 51%, that's really really good, we took 100 trades, 71 win, 29 losses, profit factor is 2.45 which is much much better. If we have a look at consecutive wins and losses, there's actually uh, a decrease, uh, consecutive wins only 6, uh, consecutive losses uh, 3, but it's definitely a much more stable curve towards the upside than we saw on the previous trade. That's why it's much better to trade with the trend 
the overall trend and direction rather than buying pullbacks uh, which is what I know for many many years but when we are back testing out this just proves it that only taking sell orders is much better on a nice trending towards the downside market if you're going to be using the williams alligator indicator maybe try this method over here it's a great method to maximize your pip gain so once we get our bearish engulfing candlestick to enter our trade and reach our first take profit level you may want to know where to exit our trading position well i say once we reach our first take profit move stop loss to entry for risk-free trading so even if the market does turn around you don't lose any more money but let's say you close a portion of your position on the first take profit and let the trade run so where do you want to close it well you want to close it when it crosses the second line over here this line of the alligator indicator is where you want to close so if we did not close look at this from 10 pips profit it becomes to around 33 pips profit as you can see over here this is where it crossed this is where you could have potentially closed it for 33 pips profit guaranteed or if you was quick enough you could have potentially even maximized your pip gain to around 55 pips over here but following the strategy if you wait for the candlestick cross of the middle line it would have been 33 pips if you closed it a little bit earlier could have been 55 so this is a great way to maximize your pip gain especially when you are scalping so look at this from this candlestick over here 6 45 in the morning to around this one over here 8 45 in the morning basically two hours time you could have banked yourself easy 55 pips profit only by letting the trade run rather than closing it over here for small profits you could have potentially banked yourself a nice big trade towards the downside what i also did is back tested this trading strategy on usd japanese yen five minute time frame and look at this win rate 82 percent profit and loss 88 percent so you would have had from an initial investment of one thousand dollars could have had one thousand nine hundred and seven dollars profit which is great we also played 100 trades as always look at this 82 wins 18 losses one to one risk to reward this was really really good time to place buying positions for usd japanese yen and to quickly show you that this trading strategy works this is a real-time trade as you can see shooting towards the upside i based my decision of this bullish engulfing candlestick shooting towards the upside nicely look at this a nice 55 56 uh, dollars profit this is also my challenge account uh, if you saw my series look at this 68 70 so i'm closing it off nicely and this uh, gives my account balance 625 dollars which is great look at this beautiful trade so this trading strategy does work i took this trade on the one minute time frame instead of the five however it works the same way on the lower time frame as well as the swing trading time frames as well so if you enjoyed this video make sure to watch this one next because this one is really really good